I am on a never ending quest for the best CAD mouse money can buy. I've tried a lot of gaming ones like this. The issue always is there's not enough tilt in there and it starts to make my arm feel bad. This is a great mouse, use it for travel, but I can't really use it for my daily. Currently, I am on the MX Master 4. I love this thing, love the feel of it. I love that it's got horizontal scroll, a couple extra buttons, and then this scroll wheel is probably the best in the business, solid metal. One thing I hate though, I really can't stand this about this. I thought I would love the silent clicks. But I, I hate it. I feel like I'm not doing anything when I'm clicking. Like it's just like unsatisfying for me, especially with CAD work. So bring us to this, the ProClick V2 from Razer. This is probably the closest thing to the MX Master Series out in the market. I know Keychron makes one that's a similar competitor as well. I love Keychron stuff, by the way, that's my keyboard. Um, but I have never tried this mouse and I really, really want to. So let's see here what we got. Pretty clean looking box. That was unsatisfying. It's stuck. Okay, try this again. <laughs> that was also unsatisfying. Hey, there's the mouse. I'm good at YouTube. I'm good at this. Ooh, okay. Nice feel. I know some of you hate that, but I kind of love it. Let's see here. Good glide, very similar glide, very similar feel. I think very similar hand placement. I have a nice tilt on there, very similar. This is the MX Master 4, very, very similar. I am noticing already though, a couple things I'm not gonna love about this as much as the Master 4. That metal scroll wheel is awesome and magnetic, feels great. This one is plastic, definitely doesn't feel shabby. It feels nice, but I can already tell it's not the same thing. Also, I'm missing the horizontal scroll. There's none here. MX Master 4 has that horizontal scroll and an extra button and the haptic thumb. So really two extra buttons over there. The Razer Pro Click has neither. Okay though. Oh, all right, so this switches click scroll to infinite scroll. Let's plug this thing in, see how it works. I don't know how I feel about the LED. Like I don't need it on everything. I'm not a gamery gamer. Ooh, you can already tell higher DPI sensor, a lot faster on the screen. I should fire up OBS. I'm gonna take this microphone off, set it down by the keyboard and mouse so we can hear those together. This is the this is the Razer Pro Click V2. All in all, I have to say this feels very similar to the MX Master series. Um, it feels a little bit lighter, feels like it glides a little better. The DPI sensor is, I think, higher. I need to check settings to see if this is something I can change or just how it is, but I definitely love how it feels. Compared to the Superlight, the Superlight glides a little faster and the sensor does go higher on the Pro X to Superlight. But the Razer is probably in the middle of those two. So more of a hybrid, getting a little bit, obviously with Razer, you're getting a little bit more into that gaming end. But yeah, great piece of tech. I'm gonna use it for a while now and we'll, we'll see how this pans out. 
All right, after using the Razer ProClick all day, here are my conclusions. I think this feels a little bit better for CAD work. I do like the click on it and I like the sensor that it's a little bit more precise. A couple things I didn't like. There's a function, you probably can turn it off, but there's a function where if you hold this center scroll button down too long, it pops up a AI prompt builder. Don't want that, don't need that. I'm gonna see if I can turn that off. I'm not sure yet. This one, I found I was missing this one in editing. The horizontal scroll I use a ton and the overall scrolling function I felt like I missed. So I think if I were to choose, can't go wrong with either, maybe a little bit boost if you're only doing CAD work and care about the, the sound of the clicks. This is the overall champ, especially if you want a quieter click, this MX Master no brainer. If you want a louder click, not doing any editing, Razer Pro click. What do you think? Which one would you get? Do you have another one I should try? Let me know.